watching out for you. This is KEZI 9 News Midday. Good morning, I'm Sean Quayer, live in the KEZI 9 newsroom. And first on Midday, we are following a developing story. Police are investigating an officer-involved shooting at a gas station right outside of Albany. Multiple agencies responded, and Springfield Police is saying at least one of their own officers was involved. KEZI 9 News reporter Jessica Debus is live at the scene with details on our top story this morning. Jessica? Sean, business is back to normal at the Jacksons and Chevron station on Highway 34 near I-5. But that was not the case this morning for several hours as police investigated this officer involved shooting. Now, in fact, the entire gas station was cordoned off by crime scene tape from just after three until about 830. All we know is that a Springfield officer was involved and witnesses are saying this incident is a result of a high speed chase out of the Springfield area, although police have not confirmed that. Employees at the neighboring Shell gas station say this was the scene when they came to work this morning. They say it wasn't just customers asking them questions, but police too. They were just sweeping the parking lot and stuff, looking for bullets on the ground. I asked one of the police officers if that's what they were doing, and they said, yeah. So it's kind of scary. Ever, any, never anything like this before, no. I mean, there's car crashes here all the time, but you know, that's pretty normal, especially next to the freeway, but never anything like this. And we have learned that the suspect's car is registered to an elderly couple in Springfield, but we are still looking into the connection there. Witnesses say they saw the car being towed away from the scene earlier. Albany police are expected to release more information soon, and we will bring you an update on KEZI 9 News at 5. And if we get information earlier, you can log on to our website. We'll post it there at KEZI.com. Live near Albany, Jessica Devis, KEZI 9 News.